I bumped them and they spun out. Well, then, then it stopped working? No, it stopped working right here. Hold yeah. Me after I pulled in. Yeah. Want me to take the body off? Uh, and the leaders continue on. Phantom. The white walls on Phantom are starting to look gray. There's dirt all over that hot rod. Now turning into a full on rat rod. Oh, I don't know why. Look at it go. Oh, 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 Almost having a catastrophic spill there. Yeah, that was the, uh, I don't know what's going on. That's the second time, the air helmet. second time that one of the lowest cars is somehow finding a way to tip over. Back to the future, tip the nice down, second place. Our grin was performing the Atomic TV is like, almost looked like this. Yeah. It's a long time to almost push it down. Go to Source Rex. Keep them out there. Go and with the Lotus Source Rex. Your mandatory driving change is one second. Go to Source Rex. Won't be able to pass to the Nico Battle District, but we'll move to next. Phantom Power Racing electing to do an earlier pit stop. A bold strategy, Cotton. All those batteries. Let's see if they're playing well. It looks like they all pulled in around. They did. <laughs> the strategy for pulling Everyone but Lotus Source Rex. Lotus Source Rex is able to gain an extra lap because everyone else went in. An excellent strategy for Milwaukee Makerspace. Who needed that time? Now a leader, the only one out. Back on your way down the track in first place. Second, back to the future, which is definitely trying to keep their title on the line. Lotus Source Rex is a really fast driver team. Now showing two laps down to the team of the He's in the right now. I'm in the pit right now, and it's the future taking more parts off. The DeLorean time machine is falling to pieces. It's like Back to the Future 3 all over again. It is. It looks like it's been hit by a train. And it has to keep going. The only way Marty can get back now. Marty won't get back to 1985 with a car like that. Meanwhile, the battle continues to put last down. Yes, Lotus Horse Rex, Chris now passed. Jimmy Nico fans are third place. Patrick, I'm back here in the FPGA pits. What happened out there? You lost the whole front end. With only three more spins left. How much more of it can you keep this car together for the end? No, not there. Not there. Well, hopefully they'll be able to do that back to the future right now. Battling Bruce and continuing on. Meanwhile, the arrest of course. Batman is put in. Looks like some adjustments. While Tom McCheney's back out of the way. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're back here, I wouldn't try to put a tire pitch into it. But TV Nico Van is doing some welding to the front end of their car. As I look through this water bottle, so it doesn't damage my eyes, I'm determining that it has to do with the steering linkage that they're welding back on in the middle of the race. Because that's what it takes to win the event race. I have an early result right now from the our boxing board. And it looks like Back to the Future is trailing behind the Batmobile. Yes, see. This is going to be really close. We've got 590 Moxie boats so far. It looks like Doc Brown is going to need some time traveling miracles before this. We're going to have to go back in time and get more Moxie boats. Because right now the Batman is keeping it strong. Moxie versus Page versus Moxie. We look to that. What will happen this year? But meanwhile, Hack the Future. 
Back pins first. Yeah. Rebecca, work on the helmet. Okay. I'm dragging now, right? Yep. Yeah. It's got a strap that hooks underneath. The Batman is definitely gaining on Hats of the Future, yeah. which means Hats of the Future now has to keep going. He needs to survive this race. Oh, no. That's the break right there. Okay. okay. It's the finish. All right, ready? All right, if I have a person to step up, I'll break it. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I was their team. I would hold off on them and try to preserve the car for the overall title. The Tesla Cup. But right now, they can't do much else because the Batman is gaining on everything. Even a college team is going to eventually get past the TV at this rate. Oh, a college team is going to use the Batman's background. It's a college team. Yeah. Oh, It's been parked over here in the runoff area. I don't know what's wrong with it. Oh, they're going to see these spots every moment. But they're just pretty confident around the track at a high five. Pretty confident in the strong trooper outfit. No, he can't win anything. I don't He's at least going to win some high five. I don't know. Iron Rose has done a best lap of 33.368. A personal best for Iron Rose. That actually is a very good lap by Iron Rose right there. I have applause for Iron Rose for that next lap that just pulled off. The comic team even has about a minute there. Off the track, got something working again. There's no all of that. Lotusaurus Rex trying desperately to hold on to third place. Lotusaurus Rex wants to walk away with each weekend with at least one medal. She might walk away with the bronze, no. After the future, she get a nice silver okay. And Phantom, certainly the favorite right now for that golden yes. So this way, Phantom is definitely in the running to the the is going to win that On your left. Hold off that but the Moxie Cup is definitely going to go to the Batmobile and keep the Moxie campaign going. Oh, Moxie Cup is going to go to the Batmobile. The toss-up now is who's going to get the Moxie Award, who's going to get the Tesla Award. Will it be Phantom or uh, 
will be back with the other if he has for the future. It all comes. I don't know who's going to win it, Patrick. It's so close. I'm ready. It's going to come down to this part of the box. Seriously, that's a good championship. It's going to go to the last lap. It is absolutely going down to the wire. And most teams are putting up an amazing fight. Bruvar and Thomas Kimmy now shooting it out for a 6 and 7th place. Bruvar has got a Thomas Kimmy hot on their heels. Bruvar trying to hold on to Thomas Kimmy. And Thomas Kimmy is 2 seconds a lot faster than him. So they have problems. Thomas Kimmy on 6th place on Bruvar. No, I don't know. I don't know if they're under, they realize they're under attack right now. But yeah, you're right, Pastor. They are certainly crossing the line there in the green pickup truck. There's a comic Chibi in the yellow VW thing right behind them. That is a battle for position right now. 67th place right there. Let's see how it goes. Comic Chibi is faster. It's a problem. It's had a host of problems. And Kubar has had not as many problems, but Tommy Chibi seems to have a better race pace. Five minutes of next driver change, and if Kubar has a problem changing batteries rather quickly, that's right. I've got that driver change for five minutes. I am seeing Tommy Chibi crawl, crawling its way closer to Kubar. Slowly inching his way towards him. Every lap, probably closer. That's a position battle right now. Kubar, the leaders. Thomas Chibi has two wheels. Yeah, and here comes Phantom. He's not here. He's not on the inside. Uba has something problem. No, Uba's no. got an electrical problem with their car. There we go. That cost him that position. That cost him that position. Yeah. That's not a Chibi. He's cheating us sixth place. But lately, we have another race now going on between the horse and scary and, and Iron Rose. Both of them, I believe, are in the pits. Iron right Rose. Now. Oh no! He's going to have to do it all over again. That's right, Iron Rose just passed the horse in the stadium, which is still in the pit. Something's wrong with the Baltimore Burners. Iron Rose moving herself off to 8th place. And it looks like Chibi and Yuki are going to try their best. They're in 5th place right now, and attacking the captain. Oh, I see the wheel buckling in Chibi and Iku there. I'm not sure what's happening. Phantom's trying to stay out of trouble there in first place. Just trying to keep it easy. Oh, oh my. There's that race in the 6th and 7th place. Oh, no. Atomic Chibi almost had it there in turn 1, but again, something happened. And now it's lost all of that ground and just made up. Right now. It's the is currently third point, but they are third place in this race. But look, at this point, if they can hold their position and get enough moxie, they can win the title themselves. Come so on, Phantom Power Racing, that hot rod out there in first place, the one that stayed out of the most trouble, is also looking for your moxie for first. It's not just Hacks the Future and Batman, but Hacks the Future right now currently in second place and survived absolutely every single possible problem that they could face. That Moxie boy going around right now with 32 minutes left to race in. Two minutes, uh, three minutes left to driver change. We're coming into our third stint then. And Hack to the Future, the story of the day. Can Hack to the Future recover from all these mistakes? Will they be able to hold off the Batman? That rise to power. Phantom rapid engine once again. Phantom definitely dominated the first day. Well, Patrick, the Phantom has to dominate this race in order to potentially have a championship hopes. That black number 48 is the quickest thing out here today. Oh, it looks like all that work is starting to pay off. Atomic Chibi now hot. Heels of Fubar. He's gonna make a pass on this one. Can't quite do it, right? He's gonna put it in the face. Not quite. And then he might have another opportunity to pass him. 